Oké, okay, dames en heren, welkom op de nabeschouwing van deze play-off uh, wedstrijd Waasland Bever Excelsior Moeskroen. Wedstrijd geëindigd um, op 2-1 in het voordeel van de thuisploeg. Bij ons uiteraard de twee trainers en ik ben uh, uiteraard benieuwd naar hun analyse van deze wedstrijd. En ik ga uiteraard uh, beginnen met uh, monsieur uh, Stork. Uh, welkom uh, to the free um, What's your opinion about this uh, match, please? Yeah, I think uh, we we lose the game in the first half. We are lucky that we cannot uh, that we don't get more than one goal. Uh, we have not a good organization in the defense. I make some some changes until the point we can get two or three goals. Uh, we played. They make it clever. They make it clever in the midfield. They have one man more, and uh, we have no. We found no way to to stop them to play the ball in this this area or to to get the ball. Then we are a little bit from nothing. We we got the penalty. We we got the the draw, and then in the half time we make some some changes also with some some players, some tactical changes as well. And then was better, much much better. And um, but okay, we had a lot of chances to score the goals, and uh, it's not the first time that we don't score. Also. Um, we make some mistakes or one big mistake then after counter attack we make a big mistake in the midfield we lost the ball easy way and then uh, we got this counter attack but it was also po possible that we can avoid this goal we had more player than than Vasland in in the in the defense and then they in in the offense but then they score to one and then we try we try we try what we had mm. not then the opportunity um, and maybe also a little bit luck in some situation to to get the draw minimum the draw so the the defeat was okay. I think they deserve this victory because of the first half. They have a lot of chances, but for us, it's, it's too less in this this moment. Also, some players are coming back. Yeah, mm. with with Taiwo, Wonji, and also Lai is coming back now. Step by step, they get their performance back. But okay, normally you have to score as well. Yeah, because after five uh, games in the play uh, playoffs. The only conclusion is that well, the playoffs is not as good as uh, the competition. Yeah, but generally the situation. Okay, our goal is I can explain again. Our goal was to stay in the league, mm. and this goal was finished after the last game. Yeah, and uh, now to motivate them yeah. again for what? So yeah. it's the mentality <laughs> in the head. Yeah, no, it's no, difficult. not the mentality. I can say nothing. Mm. I, I have to take my head what they are doing in the yeah. training session. They make a good job in the training. They want to try everything also in this game, mm. but. But now the, it's, the air is out. Yeah, the air is out. Maybe my colleague can say the same about the other games. Which which goal we have now? Which goal for for what we are playing now? Okay, we are. You can say we are professional football player. Yeah, yeah we try our best. We have to do it. But it's difficult. Yeah. Uh, but now, when we have a goal now in this playoff, of course they can say we play for this goal. But they have nothing. Yeah, yeah. This, is, this is very difficult now. We have a big goal now. We are stay in Mukon. It's on the 10th position after 30 games from zero to, to 40 points. This is a big victory and this is a miracle for this team and nothing else. This is only to prepare the team now further for the next season to give some young player a chance to play. And this is important for us okay. to see some, some difficult, different now uh, from the youngsters to the uh, etablierten yeah. players. Now this okay. is the way. Yeah. Thank you very much for your uh, uh, answer. Um, we continue with uh, Anand Kustovic. Um, I think you're very happy with this uh, victory. It's, I think, your second victory in 2019. So yeah. a very important one. Yeah, long, long uh, time that you win. Uh, when you win uh, one time in, uh, in four months, it's not uh, enough for me as a coach and it's not enough for, for my players. So I'm really happy about the prestation today. I think uh, we deserve it, especially we were good in, uh, in the first half. It was really a uh, good performance. Yammer uh, uh, for the penalty in the, in, the, in, the, in the last minutes and that was really stupid. And I think we have to avoid all these uh, falters because now in the last three games we take four penalties against from nothing. Uh, hands, uh, stupid faults and, uh, and yeah. Uh, second half, um, the... Um, my colleague uh, changed a little, little bit uh, at the end of the first half, the beginning of the second half also, changement. But I think we adapted good also to, 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 to their tactically. Uh, when they passed with two strikers, we passed with five in the back. Uh, first time with Paul, that was not a big success. So then I changed one more time with uh, Gamboa, who entered good into the game. And um, yeah, in some moments of the game also we were lucky. Uh, they also had some chances. 
we also in the counter attack had some chances and i think this uh, second goal was really deserved for us today because i think we were better team today mm. it was also a beautiful goal yeah a beautiful goal counter attack uh, louis verstrate uh, i'm very glad for him because uh, i feel the 15 games that he played with me and uh, beginning of the playoff too i i find that he was a little bit uh, tired and he needed a little bit of rest so that's why the last week i i really put him uh, on rest um, to to give to give that this energy comes back and uh, i find it today even sometimes he's still making some runnings with the ball and he can be smarter but uh, what uh, volume of what uh, of endurance uh, abnegation for the team and uh, that's really a, a team player but not uh, only him i think the the whole team or today uh, fight and they fight it also in playoff uh, playoff two when i watched the, the the first two games that was not so bad really in zulte maybe we can win against Kortrijk, it's a good team and uh, they scored in the 93rd minute uh, after we come back from 2-0 to 2-2 The game in Union, I was really disappointed with my team and I was uh, negative. But when I see now the, what uh, Union is doing uh, in the playoff two, that's not a, a bad team. And maybe I was too negative because yesterday I watched the game against Zulte and uh, they could also score like eight or ten times in this game. So that's a really good team. Then we had the game um, in circle. I think we were a better team, but we lose it 3-2. And uh, as my colleague said also, For the playoff two, it's it's really difficult to motivate them, but uh, we as a coaches we cannot uh, give up. So we have to put that energy that they need, and uh, they try their best. Uh, it's not always easy, but uh, that's the that's the playoff two. Okay, thank you very much, Alan Kustovic, and congratulations with this uh, beautiful victory.